Welcome to another video about foundation. My name is Asimulate. If this is your first time watching my channel, I explore different simulation games and share gameplay videos of those I like. Subscribe to my channel if you are also a simulation game lover. We have unlocked the contents related to commoners. Now, let's work on those connected to citizens. Before promoting any commoners to citizens, I like to ensure we have enough splendors for the various estates first. Clergy asks for 50 splendor points, Kingdom 40, and Labor 50. Comparatively, it's easier to raise splendor for the Kingdom and Labor. We just need to hang more flags onto our military keep and mana. For clergy, it takes a while, as we need to add extensions or bell towers to our churches. To make beer, we need to build a brewery, which does its magic with wheat, hop, and water which farm we already have. Let me build a hop farm here, and a brewery not far away here. This game has a very interesting concept. Beer is considered a luxury and only citizens drink beer. It's good these buildings are unlocked it before we have any citizen in our village, allowing us to have beer ready for our very first citizen. However, we need to be mindful not to produce beer too early it's a pity to have beer sitting in a granary collecting dust. Tarfen is where we sell our beer. That's why I put it right next to the brewery. It was unlocked it after we had enough commoners. Again, we can have it built before having citizens. To make sure people will visit the tarfen, I surround the houses with a wall and integrate the exit or entrance with the tarfen equipped with two doors. In this way, people are always reminded to grab a beer before going home or going to work. Excellent! On the other hand, we need to have things ready within the tarpon to make it work. First of all, of course, we need a service counter to sell our beer. And then the public lunch is also mandatory. People need somewhere to sit before they would consider buying a beer. I also build a kitchen which offers nice tasty meals. And then we can promote commoners to citizens, and novices to soldiers who would then need access to goods and luxury. Checking our finance at the end of the month, our tarfan is doing really well, bringing in 8,200 coins. Beer is selling, what is also selling is the jewelry our soldiers got us through military missions. Our citizens and soldiers desire luxury products. In addition to beer, we can offer a couple more, now that more content has been unlocked after we have enough citizens. We can mine gold, build a gold smelter to make gold bars and then a jeweler's workshop to make rings. However, we cannot really plan a smooth production because gems can only be randomly found in the various quarries. Once we have 10 citizens, we can unlock monastery and the clergy estate. After that, we can concede villages to monks and start producing honey as well as herbs in the monastery. Both are luxury goods we can sell in the market. As our population size grows, our overall happiness level is gradually dropping. Something I need to fix right away. Okay, I hope you enjoyed this video as well as the game. Stay tuned and enjoy Foundation. See you next time. Take care.